Welcome to another heartwarming episode of Australia's favourite wartime family, the Silly Vans. A saga of one family's struggle against the evil forces of Willisie at Seven and MASH. You may recall in our last episode, Grace was bitten by the jitterbug and hasn't stopped scratching since. And Dave, proud father to Grace's 42 sons and one daughter, finally cracked it, has finally become the mayor in his quest to rule over the residents of war-torn Camberwell. We pick up our story as usual in the kitchen. Mask. Dave. Yes, yes, there, love. I'm, I'm home, love. Oh, uh, good. I'm not good to see you. Hi, dear. dear. Yes. You've got a party hat on your head. Oh, yes, dear. That's right. I, Why are I, you wearing the hat, Grace? Well, I thought you wouldn't remember, dear, that it's uh, well, it's a very special day, Dave. Ah. Uh, yes. Grace, what's so special about today? Well, d uh, uh, Dave, uh, uh, it's just a little hint, dear. Um, it that, looks like uh, a birthday hat. Ah. Uh, you're getting close to you, yes. Oh, crikey, Grace, yes. why didn't you tell me this morning before I left to work? It's my birthday! Oh, wouldn't it drive you mad? No. What, it's Dave. not mine, darling? No, 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 dear. It's, it's another member of the family, so you've got 45 <coughs> guesses. Gee. We've got a lot of, of kids, our... you know. Mm? Grace, is it one of our boys overseas, says he with a look of pride? You are proud of our boys overseas, well, I'm aren't you, I'm very proud of our lads over yes. there fighting for this great country yes. that we live in. And you should be too, you know. Why? I had a letter from Archie overseas, and he says he's become a tail gunner. A tail gunner? Yes. Surely there are nicer places to shoot the enemy, dear, aren't uh, you, really? Yes, Grace, I mean... but it doesn't mean what you're thinking, love. Oh, I see. Listen, it's got to be your birthday. I just worked it out. Oh, he got it. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear. Thank you very Any much, Any more letters Dave? from the boys? Hmm? Any more? I've been working hard as my capacity as mayor. That's about four pints down the local. Yeah. And uh, I want to know about the boys, if they've written yeah. to you, my, oh, my well, dearest. I got a letter from Nancy, you know, the army nurse. The army... Yes. Nancy, the army nurse. Yes. yes. I'm confused. She's been going out with a private, you know. Yes. And uh, she never mentions his name. Do you think he could be the unknown soldier? Ah. Uh, do you think? Yes, he could be, Grace. Yes, yes. I wondered about that, do you? He may just like to keep things private. Yeah. Mm. And I will, And another thing I'm wondering what just happened... Just a second, Grace. Yes, dear. This could be one of our boys fighting hard on the front line. Could be one of our boys fighting the Jerrys on the front line. I'm sure I didn't hang any of those on the front line. Hello. This is uh, Central Exchange. Is that Mr. Silly Van? Uh, yes, it is. Uh, will you accept a reverse charge call from... It's got to be one of the boys. Yeah. It's Heidelberg? Gotta, it's got to be Little Archie. He always reverses Heidelberg? the charges. Yes, Heidelberg. Heidelberg locally or Heidelberg OS? No, Heidelberg locally, dear. Oh, yes, young, of young course. Young man put, on the line for you. Will you accept? Through. Right, thank you. Somebody calling oh, probably funny, business thought, about the mayor. Mrs. Gossett was the only one down a phone. The Sullivans must have got one on. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Who is it, dear? <laughs> is that you, Helmet? Yeah. <laughs> Kitty's old boyfriend, Helmet. You know, the one that's trying to be naturalised, become an Australian. Oh, yeah, that's right, yes. Helmet? Yeah. Not now, thank you. <laughs> but listen. I think Helmet's a Jerry. Or Jerry's a Helmet. I'm not sure which. Ring the um, phone again, the Murray. <laughs> the, bo the boy is... The book, leave the boy alone. Now, hello? Hello, this is Central. Yes. Uh, will you accept another reverse charge call from Heidelberg? OK, put him through. <laughs> he must be standing back the front in the phone. Uh, listen, there. is it where are the bucket of water or where is the bucket of water? Helmet. Can you tell me? I have to know this for Not my Not now, Helmet. Not now, Helmet. Hello? Hello? Helmet's trying to be naturalised. Yes. He's got to brush up on his English, obviously, oh, and he's got a enough. problem with that one, but we haven't yes. got time, Grace. Oh, here's dear we little Kitty. We want to think Kitty. of our boys overseas. Yes. And our lovely hey, daughter, Kitty, who's yeah. right with us right now. Here right. I am oh. over here. Here she is, dear. Kitty, how, how are you? what brings you Hello, into the Kitty, kitchen? Darling. Food? No, I've been, I've been... Look, I've knitted a pair of socks uh, for, for Fred, you know? Because he's overseas and I've knitted him a pair of socks. Kitty? What? Kitty, uh... There are three. There are three socks here, love. Yeah, yeah that's a pair. Have you been going to different schools again? Hey, this is a pair of socks, isn't it? How come you knit a pair of socks with three socks? You've knitted well, look, a pair got, of socks look, for our boy right. overseas. Yes, what, because dear? I got a letter in the mail and said, Dear Kitty, you won't know me when you see me next because it's from Fred, see? Oh, yes. And he said that since he's joined, joined the army, he's grown another foot, so oh. I made him three for his other foot. Two ding-a-lings in the one family. Yes. Well, oh, Kitty, dear. 
You go over there There's a and, now. and work on another letter and, and write to one of our boys. Right, right. Cheer our boys up, will you? Ah, dear little kitty. She, she tries so well hard, you know. She brings tears to my eyes. I'm Me so too. I'm so proud of that girl. <laughs> We're a, a proud second. family, really, aren't I, we? I think I hear someone at the door. Oh, right. I'll just go to the door now. Dave's going to the room. <laughs> oh. Ah, g'day, 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 Dave. Oh, g'day, g'day, mate. Get uh, up. This is Acme Asphalt calling. It's Harry uh, again. Listen, Harry. No, no, I'm onto a new lurk, mate. It's a beauty. Yes, Harry, look. Now, it's Acme Asphalt. Don't you want your, your driveway asphalt? I've got this uh, load of black market asphalt out yeah. in the truck. OK, look, Harry. Yeah? Not now, thank you. Oh, right. Fancy treating. Oh, fancy treating your brother like that. That was Harry, love. He's selling the asphalt on the black? Yeah. Black asphalt again. How yeah, disgusting. Yes. Can't get rid of him. Don't know what we'll do about Harry at <laughs> no. all. Hmm. Tell me, love. Yes, dear. While I've been slaving away down at the council offices today, any other boys ring up to make me proud again? Uh, well, I don't know, dear. Letters have been far, you know, far and, and, and few between. Or they, golly, yeah. is that the yeah. phone? Hmm? Yes, it is the phone. It could be one of our boys from overseas. <laughs> no, it is not. It is Helmut. Oh, it's that yeah. stupid Helmut again. Listen, Helmut, what do it, you want? Finally, what do you want? Is it where is the bucket of water or where is the bucket of water? Just a second, Helmut. Yeah? Is Darling? this bucket of water thing? I mean... He wants to know, is it where is the... Where, what's that, Helmut? Is it where is the bucket of water or where is the bucket? Is it plural or singular? Is it where... No, look, you've got it. Look at it this way. Yeah, Shall we give it, it to him straight? Yeah, give it to him straight. Right. Yes, yeah. Yeah. It's... We have no buckets of water. Uh, we, we ha just yeah. a second, I write this down. We have no buckets of water. You have no buckets of water. You have no, no buckets, buckets of water. water. I have no buckets of water. Mm. I, I have, have no buckets of water. And they, have, they no have no buckets, buckets of water. water. And they, you, they, they have no buckets of water. Yeah. Yes, now does that, does that fix the problem for you? Uh, yeah, yeah, but if you haven't got any buckets By the way, of water... Yeah, why did you want the bucket of water? Well, I'm trying to tell you. I've, made, I've wasted 30 cents, I mean, three shillings, on phone calls to tell you... Why do you want the bucket of water? Why do you want the bucket of water? Well, your house is on fire, you dumb cop! Yeah! Oh! As Helmut thrown cold water over Dave's plans for a 42-room motel for his sons when they return from the war, or does the evil Helmet just have a burning desire to marry the lovely kitty? And where did Dave get that rash? And why is it spreading? For the answers, be watching for the next enthralling episode of The Silly Vans, a crawfish production.